Terry, so first things first, welcome back in front of the cameras. It's great to have you. Um, but I've, I've got to ask, how's, how's this week been? It's obviously been an interesting week full of developments and, and, and you've taken your first week of training. So how's that gone? Well, um, thanks for the intro, Sam. <laughs> and uh, it's been a difficult week. Um, I think it's fair to say um, Mark brought a lot of this current squad in and they'd have felt for him. Uh, they realised how hard he worked and how much he put in. Uh, Mark and Tom have left us with a very good squad that uh, we're hoping to just change our fortune a little bit and uh, pick up enough results to start climbing the league. So obviously the first test is York at home tomorrow. Um, so it'd be really good to in, in, in front of the in front of the East Bank to get a real you know feel good factor going, won't it? Yeah, I've emphasised to both uh, Ross and James our academy managers have come in uh, says a lot for our, our the the club set up and the academy that we're able to um, promote such talented um, coaches i'm very very pleased with what i've seen this week and as i said earlier i think we've emphasized the importance of winning at home because our fans haven't been treated to too much success at home we had some one or two blinding games but haven't been able to keep up uh, a constant winning process. We need to go on a run of two, three, four games uh, to to reinstall that confidence that we need. If I look at the squad, it is a very challenging squad, but it does lack some belief. And as much as coaches can talk about patterns and shapes and pressing, etc., it's about getting points on the board that, that will give us that confidence. Yeah. Obviously, last time out was the FA Cup, but um, last league game was obviously the Scunthorpe comeback, and, and, and it's all about tapping into that second half performance, isn't it? Showing that, showing that desire again. That's what we need. Yes and no. I think you can kid yourself by saying that. Uh, I watched the game at Chelmsford. We were pants, absolute pants, and uh, I think we've got to start again, and we've got to gain our own momentum, and we will be changing. Uh, the pattern and the shape of the side, uh, not drastically because to be fair to uh, the the two lads, we've got 10, 10 days and four games. Um, first of all, we can only concentrate on Saturday, so that that's our our priority. And we've we watched the video footage of York. They're, they're a really decent side, but you wouldn't expect me to get on here and say that the opposition weren't decent. We're in the National League, they're all decent. Um, can you tell us a bit more about what we can expect from York? Uh, obviously, we're not going to go into uh, what changes we're going to make. Uh, just try try to simplify some things. And uh, like I say, we, we have a talented squad at our disposal who I've watched every day since the season started, it is getting better, but we've only really showed that in flashes and we need to transfer what you see on the training ground, which is excellent, onto the pitch. And, and again, I could talk here for hours, but we've got to start producing wins. Click here for the latest match highlights and click here to subscribe. Are you in with a shot? Look below for more information.